Bipolar 1 disorder is a disabling and difficult to treat psychiatric disorder marked by at least one mania or mixed episode. Depression in bipolar 1 disorder has been proven responsive to alanzapine monotherapy by an international double-blind randomized placebo control trial. Today, I would like to share with you the result from Chinese subpopulation analysis to evaluate the efficacy and safety of lorazepine monotherapy on 210 Chinese bipolar 1 disorder patients. First, let's take a look at the primary efficacy outcomes. Olanzapine showed greater decrease in the matrix total score compared with placebo, although the difference was not statistically significant. However, olanzapine decreasing Chinese patients was similar to that seen in the overall population noted in the parent trial. Emergence of mania was significantly more common in placebo than olanzapine treated patients. Given that placebo cannot prevent relapse of mania as effective as olanzapine, also, these placebo-treated patients had a more rapid and larger decrease in matrix total score. This was more likely a medical episode rather than an improvement in depression reduced the treatment difference between olanzapine and placebo. To better illustrate our hypothesis, no matter using the matrix score, of the visit before mania emergent, or excluding patients with emergence of mania from the analysis. The difference in matrix changes from baseline between olanzapine and placebo groups both increased after control the mania episode confounder. Lastly, let's take a quick look of the safety outcomes. The rate of discontinuation due to adverse event and the rate of treatment emergent adverse event were not significantly different between the groups. The safety data were consistent with the known safety profile of olanzapine. In summary, olanzapine provides similar improvement in depression among Chinese and non-Chinese bipolar 1 patients, which provides another good solution for bipolar patients in China. Chinese guideline of bipolar disorder updated in the year of 2015 is also supportive and recommends olanzapine monotherapy for bipolar patients. In the meanwhile, a greater emergence of mania in placebo and high early discontinuation rate caused underestimation of the effect of olanzapine.